All right, ladies and gentlemen, we got it. Bud Light Seltzer Fall Flannel in hand. We're gonna review all four. That review is gonna start in. Hey everybody, welcome to Taste This One. Thanks for checking out today's review. Hopefully you are having an excellent day whenever you're watching today's video. Bud Light Seltzer, Fall Flannel, Variety Pack, limited time only, just hit the stores. Really excited to try this. Four flavors in the Variety Pack. We're going to start out with the uh, Maple Pear, Apple Crisp. The branding on these are really nice. 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 Of course, fall pumpkin spice. And last but not least, what I'm intrigued by the most is the toasted marshmallow. 5% um, alcohol in each one of these, 100 calories, less than one gram of sugar. We're gonna start out with the maple pear first. Here we go, cheers. Very maple-ish, maple-y. The maple just completely overwhelms the pear taste. Let me see if I get a pear, any pear flavor at the back end. There's a hint of pear, it's just the maple flavor overwhelms it. Uh, for me, it's going to be a C minus 68. It's, it, there's too much maple flavor. Um, all right, let's get into the apple crisp. Cheers. Ooh, ladies and gentlemen, this is good. You get the apple flavor, but there's the hint of the cinnamon in there. It's they could just they should just call this the uh, apple pie. That's my pie. No oh, apple crisp, apple pie, basically the same thing. You get the hint of the cinnamon. There's the flavoring of the uh, the pie crust with the apple itself. I like this. Uh, B plus 90. B plus 90. All right. We're going to the uh, pumpkin spice. Here we go. Cheers. I don't think it's bad. It's not great, it's not bad. There is the pumpkin, uh, it has a pumpkin, obviously pumpkin spice. You do get the pumpkin, but it's almost like a pumpkin squash-ish um, flavor. It's not bad, it's not great. C72? C72. All right, last but not least, the one I'm looking forward to trying, the toasted marshmallow. Let's get into this one. That's what he said. Nice crack of the can. It smells a little like a marshmallow, but cheers. Ew. There is a hint of marshmallow, but it tastes more like a burnt coffee to me. I don't like this at all. Let's give it one more sip just in case. Final 
great in score to follow. There is a hint of the marshmallow, but to me it tastes like burnt coffee or like a toffee flavor. I don't think it works well on this seltzer at all. The one that I was intrigued by the most is getting. It's going to be an F55. I really don't care for that. All right, before we wrap up today's video, leave me a comment below if you have tried these new seltzers. Let me know what your favorite one was. Definitely for me, it's the uh, Apple Crisp, not even close, followed by the pumpkin, then the maple pear, or they could just call it maple, and uh, this marshmallow is not very good. Um, so, or if you have not tried it yet, but you do go out and try it, come back to this video, leave me a comment below, and let me know your thoughts of the uh, limited time only fall flannel pack by Bud Light. So with that being said, thank you very much for watching today's video. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. It's right down there. If you want to see more of my videos, hit the subscribe button. Maybe the notification bell. This way you know I'll put out new videos. So with that being said, thanks once again for watching today's video. And until the next video, we will see ya. Bye.